Okay guys, it was uh, so loud over there. There was all kind of trucks and everything. I'm out in nature trying to get some peace and quiet and they got like the loudest stuff you'd ever hear in your life over here. Anyways, <coughs> uh, AMC, what was I saying? Oh, I'm very concerned about their cash holdings. So they had, last I heard, they had about 750 million in cash. This was like at the last um, earnings report from Adam Aaron. Um, but you know, they recently sold another 250 million after the earnings report. Um, but then they used that money to pay off a credit line. So they're still probably sitting around 750 million cash, but they're in a cash burn situation. They got out of it, but now they're back in it. And it, even Adam Aaron said himself, 2024 is not looking good for movies. 2025 and six, he said will be good. But if you look at 2024, like just open up your app and take a look at what movies are out right now. I've been trying to go to the movies for like every week I want to go, right? There's nothing out. Thankfully, a couple weeks ago, they had that Kong, like Kong versus Godzilla thing. I watched that, you know, and that made some good money. But besides that, there's literally nothing out. They have like the most horrible movies out. Like they have like all these horror movies. Why are you going to have horror movies? It's not Halloween time. Like everything out is like Satan movies, horror movies, you know, vampires, death and killing. No comedies ever. No good storylines nothing good nothing to be excited about i guess deadpool the new deadpool's coming out with wolverine everyone's gonna watch that you know it's still in that death murder category which is okay as long as it's done well written well um so that movie will make money but there's just not there's not enough movies out for to make money right now so i'm concerned i think amc is going to continue their cash burn their stock price is low right so how are they going to raise cash are they going to sell more more stock with look how low it is because it's going to continue to go down if they keep selling it and diluting right and then the shareholders are like oh man what if he does another reverse theft campaign reverse split theft campaign you know so this is all stuff to think about i'm going to continue to research this for you guys i'm going to keep a close eye on it for you i will talk to you soon make sure you hit like subscribe and notification share the video with a friend have a great day